Thank you for tuning in to A Thought for Today with me, Bro Stuff. Today is April 26th, 2023. And today we're going to be reading Psalm 118, verse 13 through 29. You pushed me violently that I might fall, but the Lord helped me. The Lord is my strength and song, and he has become my salvation. The voice of rejoicing and salvation is in the tents of the righteous. The right hand of the Lord does valiantly. The right hand of the Lord is exalted. The right hand of the Lord does valiantly. I shall not die, but live and declare the works of the Lord. The Lord has chastened me severely, but he has not given me over to death. Open to me the gates of righteousness. I will go through them and I will praise the Lord. This is the gate of the Lord through which the righteous shall enter. I will praise you for you have answered me and have become my salvation. The stone which the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone. This was the Lord's doing. It is marvelous in our eyes. This is the day the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Save now, I pray, O Lord. O Lord, I pray, send now prosperity. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. We have blessed you from the house of the Lord. God is the Lord, and he has given us light. Bind the sacrifice with cords to the horns of the altar. You are my God, and I will praise you. You are my God, I will exalt you. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endures forever. And here's our thought for today. The young campus minister was troubled, but he looked conflicted when I dared to ask if he prays for God's direction, for God's help, to pray as Paul urged without ceasing. In reply, the young man confessed, I'm not sure I believe anymore in prayer, he frowned. Or believe that God is listening. Just look at the world that young leader was building a ministry in his own strength, and sadly, he was failing. Why? He was rejecting God. Jesus, as the cornerstone of the church, has always been rejected, starting, in fact, with his own people. Many still reject him today, struggling to build their lives, work, even churches, on lesser foundations. Their own schemes, dreams, and other unreliable ground. Yet, our good Savior alone is our strength and defense Indeed, the stone the builders rejected has become the cornerstone. Set at the vital corner of our lives, he provides the only right alignment for anything his believers seek to accomplish for him. To him, therefore, we pray, Lord, save us. Lord, grant us success. The result? Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. May we give thanks to him because he's strong and good. And your action step today is give thanks to the Lord because he's strong and he's good to us in our lives. This is Bro Steph. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you on the next A Thought for Today. And remember, pray always, read the word daily, 
and always be grateful and thankful to the Lord for all he has done in your life. See you on the next Day 5 for today. Keep looking up. Jesus is returning. Bye for now.